안녕하세요. 저는 위니입니다. 만나서 반갑습니다. Sweet Home. Oh my God. If you are not watching Sweet Home, I don't know what you are doing with your life. I'm joking. But yo, yo, the way Sweet Home ended, oh my God, Sweet Home is so good. The acting is just so good. Everything about the plot, the story, the way it ended is just, wow, it's just really nice. Like even ah the monsters everyone has a story and it's just so good like it's so well done and i'm just like happy i watched this series honestly yo the way it ended ah let's talk about hyung su hyung su where did you get all that power from like we always knew that he was a monster but to me in a way like he was kind of weak i don't think maybe he was using his full power but i don't know if it was because of the eclipse or something that he just got that power and like you know his hand them like he was he killed it he, his monster power was so good <laughs> even though like yo even though he killed mr han i felt really sad like I, like i was about to cry because i personally love mr han like he's such a good actor seen him in so many series um yeah i've seen him in so many series so like i know the guy and oh i just felt bad when he when he got killed by hyung su unintentionally he took it upon himself to protect the other people so he won't have to harm other people that hyung su already cares about that guy has just gone through a lot a lot of people died can we just like a lot of the strong ones died the guy with the bun on his face died i was surprised the mr han died obviously the grandfather um orabonin he died too and i really love the guy he was always funny like he brought the fun out of every bad situation they went through who else died oh my god oh my god what's his name jaehyun the guy with the sword sword the pastor but yo when he died i was like oh my god is this really happening that no especially when he told the girl that you know it went that scene you guys know the scene i'm talking about when he admitted that you know he wants to be with her then she asked is it god's will he was like no it's my will oh my god why did he have to die after saying that because both of them since the beginning they have been together like he has been he, ah god no like i would have loved to see them together but unfortunately he died and it was so, like that one i was just like oh my god no like why did he, i loved him so much like he was such a good calm gentle fierce character that was really good like a balance like i really liked him but he died and i was just like ah the thing oh and the way he died ah no 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 Whew, a lot happened guys a lot happened concerning the ending as i said a lot of the strong ones died and the weak ones somehow survived like it's so it's so ironic like the yeah the the woman that was pregnant that her fiance was probably a monster was probably a monster I don't know the ending like she left them and i wonder why i don't know if she's still going to look for her fiance to find out what happened because the deal was off with the soldiers so i don't know why she just said oh survived then she just went so maybe she she still has unfinished business with finding her fiance or something like that maybe he's still alive you never know or oh, he's a monster and she wants to see for herself it could be that on hyuk on hyuk like the guy with the glasses the one that has always been the leader the smart guy i wonder why actually my theory is that you know he didn't want to go with them because he knew that he's going to be a monster or he's already a monster because at the end even though the camera did not show his face and like when the building was falling down um it didn't hit him but the camera showed where his like blood was dripping on um on him 
so i'm guessing like he had the symptoms of the nosebleed so he's probably going to be a monster on um maybe he might be like young su young su so you never know but that's my theory why he refused to go with his sister and the rest and yeah and my theory concerning the end you know the way it ended when young su like was at the back of the truck with the guy with a bond face driving obviously we already know that his face is scarred and it's going to somehow go back to a clear smooth skin unless like they had that kind of technology or something that could like no we obviously you can tell that it's probably the it's probably the guy that is that is like young su that is similar to him in terms of like he's not fully a monster but he has his own powers too like he's in between too like young su it's probably that same guy because he can his power is kind of like possessing other people too like other monsters i guess like other people so yeah that's his power it seemed like it makes sense that makes sense i i don't know if i wanted hyung su to give himself up but it had to be done and at the end of the day he's not even with the soldiers it seems so i do not know i'm not sure if there's a season two i hope there is because it's so it's so good but i just feel like the people that they left behind like those other people they are not strong like that so i wonder how they will survive and if they if they're season two like would there be new people that they will bring in or like they will use those same people because i don't see what they will do <laughs> with those people because they are not strong like that you know so yeah but i can see season two happening i can see season two happening and it will be awesome so yeah guys, I love this show and I hope you guys enjoyed it too as much as I did and recommend it to your friend because honestly it's so good and yeah, that's all I have for you guys today and make sure you hit that subscribe button down below, give this video a thumbs up, share if you care and also leave your messages and comments down and you know, I'll be sure to reply you and have a great one guys. Anyang kaseo!